hi everyone okay let's solve this problem right away 5 to the power of a plus 5 to the power of a equals 100 okay before I provide the solution subscribe to my channel so that you can get more of this this and this together will give us 5 to the power of a in two places or two of five to the power of a okay anyhow you want to say it and then we have 100 there i have to remove this two so i'll divide by two then on the other side you divide by two this is going with this one right now five to the power of a is equal to 100 divided by two and that will be 50 right now we cannot express 50 in this form because 50 that I know is the same as 5 times 10 right 50 again can be expressed as 5 times 5 times 2 right okay so and this can best be written as 5 to the power of a equals 5 to the power of 2 times 2. Right? So this is the best that you can write 50 if you want to express it in this form. So the best thing to do is to take the log of both sides. As we now have the log of 5 to the power of a equals log of 5 squared multiplied by 2. Now, what do I do next? The power can go behind. So we have a log 5 that is equal to log of 5 squared multiplied by 2. Remember this, that if you have log AB, that is A times B, right? This is the same as log A plus log b so i'm going to write this in this form now we have our a log 5 coming down and then it's equal to log 5 squared plus log 2 obeying this particular law then we are seeing a power again so this power will go behind so our a log 5 will simply be 2 log 5 plus log 2. Okay, let me ask you now, have you subscribed to my channel? Have you shared? Okay, if you have not, you can still do the sharing and the subscribing, right? Now, how do I get my A now? I will just divide this by log 5. Then divide this by the same log 5. And the same thing will be ap applicable to this. I think the language to use is divide all through by log 5. I think that should be the language. Now this is going to go with this one. Making A the subject. And then here log 5 will cancel log 5. 2 will be left over. Plus... We have our log 2 divided by log of 5. Now let's proceed. From here now I'm going to apply change of base to this. And this, the change of base will come in this way. A will now be 2 plus this log 2 will still appear. And 5 here becomes the base. Okay, that is what the change of base is about so we now have the value of our a to be 2 plus log 2 to be 5 but then we have to verify to be sure okay verification stage now one thing you should know again is that through the um, verification stage you're going to learn you know one or two from there so stay back and learn the equation is 5, um, 5 to the power of a plus 5 to the power of a 
to give us 100. Now, in place of a, now I'm going to put 2 plus log 2 to base 5. So, we are going to have 5 to the power of 2 plus log 2 to the base of 5. Everything there is the power. Then here again we have 5 to the power of the same log 2 to the base of 5. Now, if we simplify this and we do not have 100, that means that we didn't get the correct answer. So you need to sit back and go through this. Now, look at this again. There's a law I'm going to, you know, apply here. Imagine there is a to the power of b plus c. This is already in the form of what we have here. This is the same as a to the power of b multiplied by a again to the power of c. So I'm going to write this to be in this form. That way we'll be able to get these two out and then deal with the log. So we're going to have 5 to the power of 2 to multiply 5 to the power of log 2 to base 5. And I'm to have this in two places. Plus 5 to the power of 2 multiplied by 5 again to the power of log 2 to base 5. Now, do we have five, um, 100 from here? Let us keep going. Now, I'm going to apply another law to this. Because there's a law that says a to the power of log b to base a is equal to b. And, and if that is the case, 5 to the power of log 2 to base 5 should be equal to 2. So I will now write 5 squared is 25. Then multiply by the whole of this now will give us 2. Then plus the same thing will happen here, right? So 5 squared is 25. Then multiply by the whole of this is going to give us 2 again. And then from here you apply your board mass. You multiply before you add. 25 times 2 is 50. Plus 25 times 2 again is 50. And then 50 plus 50 is what? 100. Remember that we're looking for the 100 on the right hand side. Because the equation is 5 to the power of A plus 5 to the power of A equals 100. So this means that we are very correct to say that our X is um, 2 our a rather our a is 2 plus log 2 to base 5 thank you for watching and um, if you have not subscribed i need you to subscribe